Hi everyone, it has been a historic season for the Wilmington football team. The Hounds won 13 games this season and advanced to the state championship for the fourth time in school history. But for the second straight season, their run would end in Hershey today to Southern Columbia, a team that's won eight state titles and 31 consecutive games. The Tigers, same team that beat them 48 to nothing last year, but this season it was a whole lot closer. We go to the first quarter and an opening drive, a break for the Hounds. They fumble on the five yard line. Colton Richards recovers it so the Hounds dodge a bullet and the fans love it. Wilmington would put together a long drive of their own. Ethan Susan finishes it with a two yard touchdown run. So Wilmington strikes first at six to nothing. Then later in the second quarter, they strike again. Robert Pontius, little floater to Cam Merritt, 13-yard touchdown, and we were tied at 14 at the half. The second half, though, was all downhill. Southern Columbia's Gage Garcia somehow emerges from the pile, scores from 26 yards out. That gave him a 21-14 advantage. And then in the third, the Tigers dump it off to Garcia, and he's gone. A 37-yard touchdown. Gage Garcia had 134 yards rushing today and five total touchdowns. His younger brother, Gavin Garcia, a freshman, rushed for over 100 as well. He scored twice. Wilmington falls to Southern Columbia again, 49 to 14 Hounds. Their only two losses this season, consider this, came against state champions. Josh Forketic spent the day in Wilmington and has more from Hershey. It was a tough break for Wilmington today. They had that 14 to 7 lead right before the half, but they allowed a touchdown, a controversial one at that as well. Looked like the player was down at the one yard line, but instead they go into the break tied at 14, and then Southern Columbia scores 35 unanswered points in that second half. But hey, this Greyhounds team, a very proud bunch and happy to be back here in Hershey for a second straight year. This is a very, very, very dominant team that we were up against. To have them 14-14, I think, says a lot about the belief, the buy-in of our kids and the character of our kids. They came out here today, they fought and they battled, and I couldn't be more proud of our boys and our team. We had to change some things uh, going to half, and, um, you know, they, they changed some things as well. They ran the plays that were going to burn us, and we took away, we tried to take away their uh, big players, but they really, uh, they shined. I mean, we came out here knowing that Southern Columbia was a good team, but we had full faith in, in each other that we were going to come out and put up a fight. I couldn't be more proud of our seniors and how they battled back from everything. That wraps things up for our Valley teams. Game still being played here in Pennsylvania. Penn Hills and Central Mannheim going head to head in the state final here coming up in just a bit. But for our teams in Ohio and Pennsylvania, a season well done. Farrell State champs, Wilmington and Girard State runners up. For the final time here in Hershey, I'm Josh Riquette, Sports Team 27. We'll be right back.